it was something like £2,398. Let me tell you guys what I bought and why I bought it. ordeal over that or whole ordeal just there that trip to the shop doing that that was all sparked because of the comment section from yesterday's vlog Alice the cable management Alice the cable management your desk is awful I fixed it I hope you're happy that literally took me half an hour so guys welcome back to a Friday evening in the life of, well, in the life of me. I've been super, 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 super busy today with worky type things. I also managed to get a gym session in because, well, I haven't been to the gym since I went to Spain. And honestly, it's absolutely incredible how much, like, how much strength you lose just by not going to the gym for a couple of weeks. It's, oh, I swear I've already got one of these. This is, this is really cool. Only a nerd would like this. I've, I've, I've already got one of these, though. Look, guys, it's literally a Kingston PCIe MVME drive. Kingston have already... Kingston have already sent me one of Kingston have already sent me one of these. I don't know why they've sent me another one now. Now I've got two of them. Now that is storage on steroids, and I've already got one. 480 gigs. I'm gonna put this back in the box because I know exactly, exactly what that's for. It's for a project later on. This week? Next week? Next week. Next week. Now today guys has been a very, very, very strange day for me and I'll explain why in a second. I'm on an electric skateboard right now because I wanted to prove to you guys how easy it was to take them down. And also how easy it is to put them back up again. Now the reason why today has been strange, other than the fact that I haven't actually been able to vlog in daylight today because I've been working. Well, to answer your question, what was different about this morning is five minutes after my alarm went off, I spent £2,000. Two thousand, two zero zero zip five minutes after my alarm went off in bed on my laptop in my boxes, and that is why, guys, out of all of the days this week, this one has been the most strange. I'll explain what I spent that money on a little bit later, and trust me, it involves you guys. You'll want to stick around to hear what I spent the money on. <laughs> So you guys evidently know that I love film. My whole persona on YouTube is about film. Making this vlog look cool, doing little transitions like this, and just genuinely love and a passion for film. But the funny thing is I haven't seen an actual film in a long time because I haven't had time. So everybody's raving about this horror film and it's called It. I'm gonna go and see it this evening. This is gonna be a little review. Tonight we'll see and hear first hand now, if I'm going to do a film review for you guys, I need some food. And that food needs to be of the highest quality. Nando's. Third time in a row this week. I suppose though, setting a good example, there is worse things you could be addicted to. Guys, it is over. It being the film that we just watched. I had my camera confiscated, obviously it was a dumb idea trying to take a camera. Cinema, they, conv they took the camera off me, obviously. It's kind of expecting it though. Short review of it when we get home, because it's quite late and I'm freezing. It, a 2017 film review by Mars Bar. The things I liked. It has Finn Wolfhard in it, who plays Mike in Stranger Things. It has lots and lots of jump scares. It's very scary. And it has an okay storyline. Things I didn't like. It's very scary. And it has an okay storyline. What I would say to you is if you are a fan of scary things with a slight bit of story behind them, go for it. But if you really thrive on a good story, that is what makes a film for you, then Possibly this isn't the film for you. I felt like this was just a B-Tech Stranger Things, but the film version. 
It was also very long. Whoa, hey guys, this is the moment of truth. Are you ready? Three, two, one. Hey, it works! There's one thing I swear by, it is 100% Loctite glue. You wanna glue anything together, use Loctite. It is the best stuff you can ever use. Not sponsored, I've used a lot of glue in my time because I've built a lot of setups in my time and setups require- Honestly, trust me, next time you're buying glue, get Loctite, you'll be fine. I just picked up this thing whilst I was at the shop. My plan is with this thing is to put it up there and cover those horrible cables which yeah. The whole reason I bought these plants yesterday in Ikea was to, well, sort this room out because I sort of like neglect it a little bit. It's really cool, but I just neglect it and it turns into a tip. To be fair, to be fair, I've got a lot of cleaning up to do. I don't really, I don't really know what's gotten into me. So with that being said, tomorrow I need to do some cleaning. But first, some news. Let people do what they need to do to make them happy and you do what you need to do to make you happy. That is what I always say to myself when I find myself automatically judging other people's actions. Now this morning, I spent over 2,000 pounds on Apple's website. It was something like 2,398 pounds. Let me tell you guys what I bought and why I bought it. I bought, well, two of these phones, but not, not this one, the iPhone 8 Plus, 64 gigabyte, two of them in rose gold. Yes, I know, nobody can use two phones at once, more on that in a second. I also bought a new Apple Watch. I bought the Series 3 with cellular. Cellular. It has cellular in, in the watch. Now this is a big upgrade for me because I've got the Series 1 Apple Watch and it is absolutely awful. Well, it was good. It's now quite a few years old, so now it's awful. I'm not lying, like, I can't use the thing without it lagging. It just lags, so I just prefer to use my phone instead of the watch. What's the point if it's lagging? I spent that much money and I know what all of you are saying. Alex, why the heck have you done that? What's the point? You've got a phone that works, it's the iPhone 7, it's literally the red one, the most recent one that came out. What are you playing? Coming back to that phrase, let other people do what makes them happy and you focus on what you want to do to make you happy, okay? What makes me happy is making other people people happy. Hence why I make these vlogs every day. I'm assuming because they make people happy when they watch them. I mean, I'm hoping they do. If, if these videos aren't making you happy, then I'm not 100% sure why you're really here. X in the top corner. There was three main reasons why I bought the iPhone 8. One of them was because I wanted to see what it was like in the hand to hold it myself to actually see it. The second reason all revolves around this camera. I want to tell you guys what I think about the iPhone 8 when it comes out on release date. I've ordered them for release date. We're getting them on release date. And the third reason, I want to give one away for you guys. So if you guys are wanting an iPhone 8 giveaway when it comes out, I bought two of them. So on the release date, I can give one of these phones away to one of you guys. Drop me a like rating down below and let me know if you'd want that. If not, I'll just pick up one of the phones. But if you want a giveaway for an iPhone 8, please let me know because I've ordered two, but I only have to take away one. So let me know. I'm gonna whack down the blinds, guys. Three, two, one. Go have a bath and then get some rest, guys. I'll see you in tomorrow's vlog. Guys, my name's been Alex. You guys have been awesome. Guys, stay awesome. Keep smiling. If you wanna to chat to me, I'm on Twitter at Mars Bar Gaming. I try to chat to you guys as much as possible. So if you ever want me, guys, reach out, but I'll see you guys in tomorrow's vlog, guys. The light racing would be wicked. Adios. <laughs>